Ah, all right, so today's uh, video is a bit of a frustrating rant towards the UPS or United Parcel Service or whatever UPS stands for. Probably involves something about sucking <laughs> because I hate whenever I order something online. And to be fair, I order a lot of weird random things, exotic things that I can't just go to any old store to buy. So I'm stuck buying things online, sometimes from very far flung corners of the universe. But, uh, you know, I always dread whenever I see that it comes up when I get that tracking number and it's based on UPS because they are terrible. Or at least in my experience, they've always been really bad. Though in all fairness, FedEx has not been that much better. <laughs> but I feel like this happens to me a lot with UPS where I order something, time passes when I'm, it's expected to be there, and then I check the tracking number and they're like, yes, it's coming today. And I'm like, yay, I can start on my project. And then the day ends. And then I check it. They're like, oops, sorry, it's going to be late. But there's, but that's usually like, say, if I order something on Am, off Amazon, Amazon says that and Amazon keeps saying, okay, it's arriving today. UPS is more like out for delivery and then nothing. And the next day out for delivery and nothing out for delivery. And it just goes on for days and days and days. It's like, I wish they could just give you an update that it's going to be late. Like, I don't understand why that's like a problem. Like UPS doesn't do that. Like if, if it's out for delivery and they aren't able to deliver it, I would just like to know, like if the, was it on the vehicle and it just didn't make it to the destination and they just, I don't know, ran out of time that day, you know, is it still really back at a facility and hasn't actually touched, you know, a, a truck to actually be on the road to get to my house? Like I have no idea. It's just this general, it arrived because it, the way I, it arrives, apparently some facility that is many, 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 many miles away from me. So I don't know if it's accurately like still there. And it's like, can I, I can't go to that. I've tried this with past packages. I can't go to that facility and like demand my package. And it's just like out somewhere in the world. And, and, it, and it bothers me because often when I'm ordering these things, it's because I've got a project to take care of. And I've been waiting to finish this filter, <laughs> this, this mechanical and bio filter for a week now. So I know when I record these videos, it's hard to tell how much time has passed. Perhaps you could tell by my lingering nasal congestion that I was sick for a while. So the right side is I've been sick, so I haven't really been able to do much anyway. So, you know, I guess that worked out well in some ways, but <laughs> I'm waiting for that stuff to arrive so I can finish this project and get this system going. Now here's the real kick in the face, and I'll talk about this in a separate video. In that tank right there is about 15 goldfish. So I actually already have fish in the system because I've been counting on that to get done. Because I did technically have something running. I had to remove that filter box because I had a little bit of a leak. But uh, maybe I'll talk about that in a future video. Um, and I didn't have the final media. I just had like a basic, I just threw some stuff in there to act as like a mechanical and bio filter. But I ended up removing it because I had to fix the leak. And I was like, I might as well wait for the material because it's going to be here like any day now. And a week later, it's not here. So I am beyond frustrated. <laughs> so I'm beyond frustrated. I want to be able to finish this project, get it running. Um, anyway, I'll talk about all those updates in future videos. Thank you so much for um, listening to my rant and maybe commiserating with me if you've had problems with UPS. If you hate UPS, <laughs> let me know in the comments below. Heck, if you hate any carrier, I'd love to hear your complaints because I'm just a uh, ball of angry right now. So I would love to vent with people. Let's all just be jerk faces. <laughs> anyway, thank you so much for watching. I'll be providing more updates on this aquaponic system. I'm going to record another video about the fish and the, the tank heater. So um, keep an eye open for that. I produce a video every single day at this point. So subscribe <laughs> and you'll get constant Punky Rooster entertainment. As always, thank you for watching and thank you for joining me on this journey.